Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you one of the many ways to clone a virtual machine in Hypervisor 6 ESXi without using vCenter. I'm currently using the free version, but the process is the same for the paid as well. Now, in this tutorial, I'll be cloning Ubuntu. If you're running something like MySQL or any sort of database, I suggest you power down the uh, VM before cloning. Once done, head over to uh, Configuration tab, Storage, Data Store, right click, Browse Data Store. Here, select the root directory and create a new folder. I'll name this Ubuntu Clone. Perfect. I'll be cloning Ubuntu 15.10, so I'll head over to that folder. Here I can select all the files if I want, but in reality all you need is the uh, VMX and the VMDK. So select it, copy it, and place it inside the uh, clone uh, folder we just created in the data store. This will take a while depending on how big is your uh, VM. Once done, uh, locate the VMX file, right click, and add to inventory. Here, change the name. Again, I'll name it to Ubuntu Clone. And click on Next. Here, I'll click on Next. Again, click on Finish. Perfect. Now it has added our Ubuntu Clone VM. It's really simple. Now, if we go to virtual machines here, we go to the settings of this uh, VM, you'll notice that it'll be using the new VMX file. As you can see. Now, all we need to do is power our newly cloned VM. And I'll launch the, uh, the console and it probably gives us a little pop-up here there we go virtual machine message here select I copied it and click OK to continue powering on the clone thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comments section below if you like to watch more related video tutorials like how to migrate from Windows to Linux or how to install Linux Mint on VirtualBox you can click on the proper thumbnail on the screen Thank you for watching.